All right, let's see what she does. Hopefully I can grab it from there, at least maybe bring it to me. That's not bad at all. I mean, and let's think about this. So the way I had to pick up that block, you seen it over the, you know, over the back of the machine. So I couldn't hang it from the coupler like I normally do. So you actually had the weight out outside of that coupler. You know what I mean? Cause it was resting that block was resting here instead of hanging straight down it was actually out here so you had to wait two foot outside of that coupler i mean i could grab i could probably find another chain i don't think i have this is my block lifting chain i mean you can tell it's nice shiny um we use it all the time and i'm that's why i made that deal that fits it um i guess maybe no because these are 40 mil pins Minor 45 I was thinking even if it was sloppy but it wouldn't be a be too tight anyways um, I don't know guys that's that's a slick little dude let's uh, I've got some dirt let me go get the bucket back on and we'll dig some dirt with it
Give me just one minute. Just figured I'd try that real quick. I just got done with the other video. This is the SV40. The MR SV40. Can't get my screen to pop up. There we go. Um, this is a Weber, I don't know, something 85. It is a TRC85F. Weighs 3,085 pounds. Picked it up with the bucket on because uh, I didn't think about pulling the bucket off, but it picked it up with the bucket on. And when I did it with my, my Yamar 50, I didn't take, I had my coupler, I don't know, my picky up thing, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, but with the bucket on, it picked up 3,085 pounds. Granted, I had to work it a little bit, get it close to the blade, pick it up, but uh, that's pretty impressive. Over the blade, blade down. But anyways, there you go. Extra little tidbit.